All right, Bacon Beast Breakfast, the triple B. We're going to check it out on a biscuit. I guess that's four Bs. Uh, let's go. Cue the intro. What is up, everyone? It is the endorsement, and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. Uh, a little while ago, I'm not sure when this video is going to come out. I've been uh, filming videos by the truckload. A truck just backs up. Beep, beep. My voice still early in the morning. Truck backs up and it uh, just unloads some videos and I review them. It's just uh, the way it goes. Uh, so here we go. I'm going to tell you right off the bat. Uh, $4.99 for the Bacon Beast Biscuit Sandwich. Uh, they're doing this whole Bacon Beast menu. I did the Bacon Beast uh, Burger. I think that's what I was trying to say. Maybe I said it. Uh, Hardy since 1960. And if you're on the West Coast, you're rocking with uh, Carl's Jr. Carl Jr.'s? Carl Jr.'s? Carl's Jr.? Carl's Jr. Uh, what I was about to say, I reached in and grabbed this. Uh, $4.99. There better be 36 uh, slices of bacon on this because this is a light, very light and uh, small, small sandwich for $5. So yeah, there you go. They throw a bacon sticker on it. We're going to check it out. Let's go. All right, check it out right there. I will tell you, it does look loaded with bacon. You see the cheese and uh, the egg. But let me just tell you, this is a tiny sandwich. It kind of looks big when I hold it up this close. But when I hold it back here, this is a tiny sandwich for $5, uh, $4.99. Uh, so yeah, wish me luck. This is the Triple B uh, breakfast. I guess it's four Bs because you're going to have the Bacon Beast Breakfast. Biscuit breakfast sandwich. Four Bs. Take that. I don't know what that means. All right, here we go. Wish me luck. Gonna do the uh, Guy Fieri hunch. This does feel soft, has a nice little texture to it, uh, a little buttery on the bottom. Uh, so I think this is gonna taste pretty good. We're gonna go right into this section right here. You wanna see the section? That's the section. It's early. Let's take a bite. Yeah. I mean. All right, so listen, washing it down with a caramel craze signature ice latte. I finally got around to filming this. You're probably seeing this video before this video. So that's a little uh, sneak peek, I guess. All right, cleaning the uh, palate right there. Um, this is good. A really nice tasting, fresh. This uh, biscuit is amazing, pillowy, and I'm really liking the buttery flavor of it. Uh, but let me just tell you, you're going to call something beast, uh, bacon beast biscuit. You got to throw some more bacon. I get it. I think there's three slices of bacon in this, full slices of bacon. Give me six. Give me six slices for this $5 price tag. And then we'll talk. Uh, I mean, I really do like it. I just wish there was more to it for the price that I'm paying. This is easily a $3.99 uh, sandwich. This is such a small sandwich. Uh, but let me take another bite. I'm going to save the rest of it for when I go inside. I'm going to put a little Frank's Red Hot into the mix. Uh, one more bite. All right, so listen, let me just give it a rating. Uh, I enjoyed it. I just think it's overpriced. Uh, everything tasted uh, very nice. I think it was made well. It was made fresh. I had to wait five or 10 minutes, uh, probably not 10, five, six minutes. Uh, so I like it. Uh, just don't love it. I just wish it was bigger. Have I said that enough? Michael Scott reference, insert picture here. Uh, so yeah, on a scale of one to 100, with one meaning don't even waste your money, and 100 being the promised land of I'm going to give the Bacon Beast uh, Biscuit Breakfast Sandwich from Hardee's a rating of, a rating of, eighty. Four. I'm going to give it an 84. It just missed the 85 barrier. Um, and you know that's normally for nice. It's just nice. 
85. Uh, so I'm giving it one notch below because I think if it was bigger, there were more uh, substance to it or the price was a little bit less, uh, that would be a little higher. But uh, yeah, there you go. Another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media getting the word of my channel out to the masses. In closing, uh, let me know. Bacon. <laughs> I always keep wanting to say Burger Beast. Uh, again, shout out Burger Beast. Um, but uh, Bacon Beast. Bacon Beast breakfast. Triple B's. Gonna get you tongue tied. And uh, I'm showing you a bag as I say my outro. Uh, that's it. We'll see you soon with some more reviews. Bye. <laughs> what was he doing? Taking a bow? What the? <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs>